Okay, here's this little uh, sump pump alarm thingy. Uh, what it uses is a float switch. And this sits above the, the highest water level you'll see in the sump. And when it rises up, uh, I'm going to use my finger. You'll see the alarm will come on and the, the light will come on. And it'll stay like that. As the switch goes down, it goes off. Everything's fine. But we're going to keep it up. And then when you come running down the steps to see what's going on, you can turn an annoying horn off. And now I have three switches for on this one normally, and I have to find out which one is really the problem. It keeps the circuit simple to do it this way. So I'm going to push each one until the red light goes off, and that will tell me which, which uh, pump is flooding, basically. So in this case, the left is my... Uh, the sump pump in the left side of my basement. I push that. Oh, it's saying it's that's the one. Huh? I don't believe it. Yeah, it's not the middle one. So it's the one on the left. And uh, that's it. So you know where to go and look to find out which pump isn't working. In my case, the center switch is really a laundry tub. And just in case the washing machine should overflow it for some reason, it'll give us a warning. We're never out of the house when the washer's running. Anyway, that's it.